Yo guys, welcome back to another vlog. If you guys are new here, make sure you're going to like, smash the subscribe button as we are 50 subscribers away to 300 subscribers, which is amazing. Thank you so much for the support. And you're like, Josh, where have you been? You haven't been uploading in like a long time, like a week nearly. You know, it's crazy. You might, you might not know, you may or may not know. My phone got water down when I was on, when I was on holiday in the beach. Uh, I got back from holiday about Sunday night, like Monday morning, like midnight basically. Um, but actually, days before, a few days before I went home, um, obviously to go back to the UK, from Greece to the UK. I uh, had a severe, uh, you know, a severe hypo, my diabetes, you know, I've got type 1 diabetes, me I may not know. Uh, I had a very, very severe hypo, it's very crazy. Went to the Greek like doctors, like the nearest one near us, um, and they sorted me out. I still had high blood sugars, and my numbers were not very good back then. And then I settled down, I was fine. And then, a day after that, a few days after that, I went back home, um, and then, um, and then I think Tuesday, I think Tuesday afternoon or something like that. Tuesday afternoon, yeah. I had another hypo. I think it was a hypo or a hypo, I'm not sure. Basically, it was very severe. And I woke up, well, I was on my laptop. Close to my, I, can't use, I can't use my phone because my phone had water damage. My phone was just broken. So I was in my bed, watching some YouTube on my laptop as you do. Tuesday afternoon, you know, just chilling out, relaxing. I couldn't vlog really because, like, um, my phone had water damage and this camera is not as great for vlogging for vlogging because the quality is not as good. Anyway, um, and then Tuesday afternoon my mum found me. Well, I was actually in my bed. Um, I was actually like droopy. I was like, I was like that. My chin, my, my, my like cheeks were like sobbing like that. <laughs> I know it's crazy, very, very scary experience. And I just thought I'd say this because like this is my life, my vlog, my, you know, I'm sharing my life with you every day. Very scary. I, I, a and E came in, well not A and E, sorry. Um, ambulance came up to our house, paramedics came to our bedroom, sorted me out, sorted me some sugar. Um, my mum was actually on the phone to the operator whilst the ambulance were driving over to our, over to our house. And mum, my mum was on the phone to the operator talking about like what I should do, like, what, what my mum should give me, like sugar, because I was having a very, very bad hypo. And yeah, my made this like water with like sugar paste, with like sugar and water, and stir it together, makes like sugar paste. She put that around my mouth to make me go, my numbers go back up again. So I was having a very, very severe hypo back then. I think that was Tuesday afternoon, yeah. And the paramedics eventually came over, like ambulance people came over to my house. It walked to my bedroom and they're helping me out. Um, can't remember a lot what they did. I can't remember a lot. But I can remember like getting like, be transferred to the ambulance and then drove to um, the hospital in Sheffield. It was very scary. And I stayed there for like a night. Um, well, I just stayed there for longer for an, uh, longer than a night, but I thought I was going to stay there for like overnight. Um, but actually, when I got to the hospital, like a few hours later, I actually had a CT scan for my head because I've actually got an ear infection. You guys might have seen the past videos; my ear was quite bad, like leaking. It's very gross, but like, um, yeah, I had a CT scan about my ear. Um, I'm also might also might be having a surgery about that very very soon, like a few weeks time, so that's some of a scary experience to the first of the time I have a surgery. Anyway, yeah, I was at the hospital, I had a CT scan, everything was good, but then I was sent straight to, I think it was uh, Hallamshire Hospital or something like that, and they were sorted out my ear, gave me antibiotics, gave me uh, my this um, drip, not drip, this like injection thing, I was on this like drip thing in my arm, where they put like um, Antibiotics, antibiotics, it's like liquid in my arm to hopefully, hopefully fight the infection in my ear. And that was very, very scary as well. I stayed there for like two nights. I was actually going to leave. I think it was. I can't remember. I think I was going to leave like Sunday night or something like that. Monday night. Uh, what it's just been. But turns out I couldn't leave that night because my number, blood sugar number was high. But that was actually my fault. That was actually the hospital's fault because they didn't actually test my blood sugars before I had my breakfast. That's what made my blood sugar numbers high. Um, like that's why it affected that and everything but yeah and then I had to stay one more night and then the next day I, get, I was able to leave the hospital like discharge from the hospital um, same hospital Hallamshire Hospital I was there for like two nights I think yeah two nights three, yeah two nights and I left like the afternoon and then um, yeah it's very, very scary and also guys my monitor my my, my meter would test my blood sugars I had water damage as well when I was on holiday, but then I've got eventually got a new one, uh, a new expert meter that is, looks like works out like numbers and everything. Um, but yeah, very, very scary experience, very, very scary experience. I can't believe it. 
hospital for like four nights, five nights, three nights, four nights. I can't remember a lot, guys. It's very scary. And also, guys, I want to show you also something. I'm also on this like monitoring thing, which basically can constantly like constantly monitor my my blood sugar numbers. Sorry for rambling on, but it's very important to say this, you know. Just so you all know. And uh, yeah, sorry for rambling on. I will be back doing the vlogging very very soon. My mum is currently sorting me out a new phone. She has to pay off the contract with my old phone, my old iPhone success. But yeah, sorry for rambling on. Um, this is just a short vlog, update vlog. No, not sure when this video is going to go up. Hopefully tonight or tomorrow night. 250 subscribers now, it's absolutely amazing. It feels weird getting back to vlogging because I've not vlogged in a long time, like a week. Because obviously my phone got water damage and it's very, very annoying. And I've lost my streaks on Snapchat. I've just been using my laptop, my MacBook. I'm back with vlogging soon. Maybe thinking, thinking Wednesday, because I'll hopefully Wednesday I'll be getting a new phone, or maybe Thursday maybe a new phone, I'm not sure. But yeah, hopefully do my new vlogs very, very soon. Today's a Friday, and tomorrow, guys, it's actually the fight. KSI vs Logan Paul, Deji vs Jake Paul fight tomorrow, August 25th. Today is August 24th, so when, when this vlog hopefully goes live, or if this vlog goes up tonight, I'm not sure. Hopefully, hopefully Logan Paul wins the fight, and Jake Paul punches Deji out, and hopefully the Pauls win. Yeah, I want to show you this monitor thing I've got actually attached to my arm. And then yesterday I went to the clinic, the hospital, but it's like a mini little hospital, so like just like meetings and things. Anyway, um, like checkups. And basically, um, I've got, well, I'll show you this first. This is basically a thing. It's like a Bluetooth like technology thing attached to my arm, which basically tells me my blood sugar number number right now, which is 9.2. And that's like the time at the bottom and like that's the number that means it's high above the yellow line basically everything like that and this is the thing attached to my arm it's like this like monitor like attached to my arm um yeah that's also crazy as well and i had like injections as well i remember waking up in like middle of the night in hospital the nurses coming doctors coming in asking me questions and uh, also you know there were little injections on me giving me antibiotics, giving me ear drops in my ear to fight the infection and it's very very scary as well because I might be having surgery on my ear but once this surgery is done, hopefully we're all good hopefully this ear will stop like, leaking and everything I'm really happy on that about that but my ear was fine like like months ago but ever since I got in that pool and in the holiday where I've just come back from my ear just got worse and worse and worse because I don't think that pool was very very clean and that's just made the infection in my ear worse. But yeah, that's an update on my life, my diabetes and everything. Been in the hospital for like four days. That's also why there's no vlogs because I've been in the hospital. My phone got water damaged. But I did upload a, a laugh cast grease like all in one vlog yesterday. So if you haven't checked that out, I'll hopefully try to remember to leave a link down below in the description so you can check that out. Or just go on my channel, Josh Vlogs, and you scroll down to the top video there and you'll see it there. Hopefully leave a like on that video and leave a comment as well. 250 subscribers right now. Thank you for watching the vlog. I'll hopefully see you on Thursday or Friday, Wednesday as we make the vlog. I'm not sure, but I'll catch you all in my next daily vlog. I'll be back down, we'll be back daily vlogging guys very very soon. Can't wait. It's gonna be absolutely awesome back on the grind. I'm just gonna take these few days, have a break, um, get my, my diabetes sorted out basically. Still a little bit shocked and everything. Scary, but yeah, I'll catch you all in my next vlog. Peace.